Okay, uh, I just got done recording. Um, I'm going to probably put that up tomorrow on Thursday. Um, my rankings. Uh, and it was a long video. <laughs> um, but uh, there's just a lot of ta talk about when you know you have to go through all 32 teams. Um, so I'm expecting that tomorrow because uh, it's going to take a while to upload. Um, so uh, this, this is going to be a fast because my, my throat is starting to go from talking so much. <laughs> uh, but Thursday night, tomorrow night. Giants hit the Philly. Um, I think Philly is going to barely win this. Again, this is a bad division, but I think they're going to squeak out the win here. Uh, next, Pittsburgh has the Tennessee. I am picking Pittsburgh to win this 5-0 matchup. I, I've talked about it in my... Um, uh, how good each team is in my rankings, which again will be up on Thursday. Um, but, uh, I mean, these two teams... Both deserve the win, uh, and it's hard to pick. I am going to go with Pittsburgh, but I think I think you know with the right circumstances, I think Tennessee can win. I really do. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Again, it's in Tennessee. I think they allow fans, so I mean that's that's going to be a factor too. Uh, next, Dallas sets the Washington. I am picking Washington to upset Dallas after you know Dallas has basically com collapsed um, after uh, Dak is uh, is out for the season. Um, and Andy Dalton is not looking good. The defense is not look good. That even that offense just does not look like it's clicking. So I'm picking Washington to upset. Uh, Buffalo heads to New York. It's gonna be Buffalo's game. Uh, it's, that one's quick. <laughs> Carolina heads to New Orleans. Uh, divisional games are tougher, but I think New Orleans has this in the bag. Uh, Green Bay heads to Houston next. <sighs> this should be a bounce back game. This should be a game where Green Bay. Should thrash them. We'll see what happens. Uh, the Titans or the yeah the Texans took the Titans to OT, um, and the Texans really let them come back. Uh, so we'll see what happens here. But I I hope that after getting beat bad last week against the uh, Tampa against the Bucks, I hope that Green Bay comes back and wins. Uh, next, Cleveland heads to Cincinnati. I think Cleveland sweeps them. Uh, they played week two or three on Thursday night. Um, and I think this is the time where Cleveland sweeps them uh, and gets another win and a bounce back win after being embarrassed by the uh, Steelers. And next, Detroit heads to Atlanta. I'm picking Atlanta here only because, again, a new head coach. They beat the Vikings last week. I think they have a chance to win this week too. Uh, next, Seattle heads to Arizona. <sighs> this is going to be a pretty interesting game. Um, Seattle... Uh, either split or lost twice against Arizona last year. I don't remember exactly. Um, I should have looked it up before I started recording this. But, uh, I mean, I think they're going to probably split again this year. I think Arizona is going to take this one, and then Seattle's going to take the one in the future. Um, so I, it's kind of an upset, but I just put it as you know a normal one because I think, again, these two teams always play close. Uh, next, Jacksonville heads to the Chargers. Chargers just came off a bye uh, this should be a pretty easy win, especially considering that, you know, the Jacksonville hasn't been playing that well recently. Um, then San Francisco with, you know, people coming back, heads to New England. I think uh, San Francisco wins on the road in New England. Uh, I don't think Cam Newton is enough to stop the San Francisco team that is slowly getting healthy. Um, they, are, they won't be 100%, again, with people out for the season, but they are getting a little bit healthy, and Jimmy Grappolo looked decent last week against the Rams. Uh, then Kansas City hands to Denver. Uh, yes, this is in Mile High Stadium, so you know can affect them a little bit. But I think the Chiefs are going to pull off a win here uh, in Denver. Um, again, it's another divisional game. I don't think this one's going to be as close as you know, say, Cleveland and Cincinnati, because uh, one team's good, one team's bad. <laughs> but um, Mile High can affect people, so we'll see what happens here. But I think Chiefs are going to win by seven points. Uh, then Tampa Bay heads to the Raiders. I am picking the Raiders, who are coming off of a bye, to upset Tampa Bay in Allegiant Stadium. Uh, something about this Raiders team is just telling me do not bet against them. I think they're a pretty decent team, uh, and I think you know they have a chance of upsetting Tampa Bay. And uh, then next Monday night, Chicago heads to the Rams. The Rams coming off of the uh, not really embarrassing, but uh, you know, a defeat against the San Francisco 49ers last week, um, and then the Bears. Uh, who they? Oh yeah, the Panthers last week. Um, uh, barely beating them by, uh, I think it was seven points last week. So I think the Bears have this in the bag. 
Um, uh, Because I I think the Rams are slowly a little bit falling apart. (laughs) Uh, So, again, it's kind of a faster um, uh, picks this week. Because, again, I just filmed a really long video. So, um, I will put this one up. And then tomorrow I will have my rankings. Um, I will not be streaming tomorrow because I don't want to watch Philly and the Giants. Um, So, for now, like the video, share the video around, don't forget to subscribe. And we are out of here. Peace.